We're starting with developing news in San Francisco where the jury is now deliberating the fate of Nemo Momeni. He is the man accused of killing Cash App founder Bob Lee. Cron Force Charles Clifford joins us now from outside court with the very latest. And we are waiting for this verdict, Charles. Yeah, good afternoon. Uh, this trial started back in mid-October, and now it's up to the jury to decide the fate of Nemo Momeni. Wednesday morning, the jury received final instructions from the judge before beginning their deliberations. The prosecution claims that Nemo Momeni stabbed and killed Bob Lee under the Bay Bridge on April 4th, 2023, because he believed that Lee was partly to blame for his sister Kazar being sexually assaulted. In their closing arguments, prosecutors told the jury that Nemo Momeni was on a mission to protect his sister and that Lee's death was a cold and calculated murder. Momeni's defense team has claimed that Lee was under the influence of drugs and alcohol just before he died. They say that Lee attacked Momeni with a knife and that Momeni stabbed Lee in self-defense. In their closing arguments to the jury, the defense reiterated their belief that Lee was the aggressor and that Momeni was simply defending himself. They claimed that prosecutors swept certain evidence under the rug and never called important witnesses to the stand. They also claimed that Mimini has not gotten a fair trial because of all the attention that this case has attracted. The jury now has four options. They can acquit Mimini, in which case he would be set free. If they believe the self-defense argument, they can find him guilty of either involuntary manslaughter or voluntary manslaughter. In either case, the judge would decide the penalty at a later date. And finally, if they believe the prosecution's argument, they can find Mameni guilty of first-degree murder, which would most likely result in a sentence of life in prison. All right, back live now. We have been told by the court uh, that once a verdict is reached, we will get about a 30-minute heads up before that verdict is read in the courtroom. But for now, in San Francisco, Charles Clifford, Cron 4 News. All right, we'll be watching. Thank you, Charles.